Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Miner here with a tutorial on how to get Zork, which is a very old and famous text adventure game, which is uh, probably one of the most known, probably one of the, actually, the very most known text text adventure game I can think of, and uh, I'm going to show you how to get it for free, because I wanted on Abandonia, and I was surprised to see, but you actually have to buy this game for, uh, what, six dollars? Yeah, six dollars, which is, you know, that's ridiculous. And I know it has multiple games or whatever, but seriously, it, it does not, it should not cost any money. It has, and, and it's got a lot of games, but this is going to show you how to get the original th three for free. So, um, first you need DOSBox, so just go here and download it. This tutorial is for Windows, although doing it for the Macintosh is very easy too. I don't know about Linux. And then, um, after you've downloaded DOSBox, just go here and here's Zork 1, 2, and 3, and you can... We're going to be using DOSBox. I'm pretty sure when this will only work on older PCs. So if you're using a new one, you're going to need to use DOSBox. So just click here. And here it is. We got this right here. And what you're going to do is you're going to open up my computer. Go to your C drive. And then search for Zork. And then drag it into your C drive. Continue. Now you'll find it to the bottom here. Uh, if you open this, you got all your information in there. So now open up a new folder and remember what you name it to make sure to name it something simple, simple, no spaces. So I'm just going to call it Zork. I already have a file called Zork, and then if you have something that two files that are called the exact same thing, it'll kind of get weird. I'm just doing this one as an example. And then you'll open this up and take everything that's in here. Alright, take all of this and drag it into your file right there, like that. Now you got this in here, and just make sure everything's in it, like that. Now you can uh, just get rid of everything and open up DOSBox. And you'll do mount cc, just type exactly what I do. And I'm using fork, like that, and you just go to your C drive. And if you go to your computer, and if you don't actually have to do this, but I'm just showing you. If you go to what you have, you'll see that the name of thing to launch it is Zork1. I can just, uh, that's it, the one thing you want to type in, so that's what you type in, Zork1. And there you go, now you're, uh, you're playing, playing Zork, as you can see. So, uh, yeah, uh, it's pretty easy. Uh, I haven't tried these other two links, but I'm pretty sure it'll work. Pretty much do the exact same thing if you want them. I'll check and uh, update the video if that's if you need to do something different. But uh, yeah. So now you're playing Zork. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and uh, thanks. Goodbye.